says a broom a mop let's be serious hi gogo fam welcome back to my channel you know today i have a whole clown <laughs> a whole mood going on here because my hair is a mess that's why i wrap it up in a head wrap you know um if you're new here don't forget to subscribe turn on the bell notification and join the coco fam before we begin before we begin shout out to the group that i was in yesterday the 25 plus guests we were facetiming having a whole vibe together being bored but you know having an amazing time so shout out to you guys if you hear this comment below lagami sako bate no stay tour tour nalo bitaw rebo sang this so sama din na rebo sa ami pero no stay okay boom lagami sako misa gelijk so yes gogo fam this is the second time that i'm recording this video because the first time i was talking about i was talking the whole time and it wasn't recording great great but yes try to this happened in the same studio that i was renting for 750 euros per month out of my pockets and if you still hadn't watched that video click on this card and check it out because it's a whole drama but 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 watch this first and then you're going to watch it i'm going to leave it on my end screen so you can click it and watch it afterwards so yes um i was renting this studio it was in a house and the house had three separate studios only thing that we had in common was the entryway so for example if we share the same entryway um when we order a package when they ring the bell it's the same bell that's going to ring for all three of us hello there was only two studios that I was rented at this moment so it was me and another girl and the third studio was empty so i began renting the studio last year in december um so it was only me and the other girl we had no problem everybody was minding their business in their shit you know blah 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 Girl, i think it was in june or first or or in april i don't know anyway it was in between those months and uh, she began renting the studio that was empty I didn't know who she is. She she really moved into the studio. I was really in my own shit and I didn't even know who ran the studio. It was just only one time that I came across her and I knew, okay, so you're the person that's running the studio. Great, nice to meet you. Anyways, days went by, days went by and Coco ordered a tripod and a ring light. So, you know when you order a package and when you receive the mail that your package will be delivered today, you're going to stay the whole day at home so you can get your package, right? So, that happened with me. I was sitting on my bed the whole day, waiting for my package, looking out the window, waiting for the bus of Pasta Now to arrive so I can get my package. I was waiting and waiting waiting and waiting time was passing by and still no bell got rang it was four o'clock still no package i got a mail i think it was at four yeah it was at four your package got delivered where where because i don't see it where's my package i don't see it i didn't i didn't hear no bell what is she talking about my package got delivered any i called the personnel i'm like hi miss you uh, i got a message that you guys are saying that my package got delivered but i still no don't see no package nobody ring the bell what is she talking about why do you send a mail that my package got delivered she was like, huh? That's weird. I'm like, yes, yeah, really weird, miss. So what's going on with my package? We're just going to check with you what happened with your package. Can be that they just pressed the button and um, put that it got delivered, but still not gotten delivered. Can also be that it's going to get delivered the next day. I'm like, so why are you 
sounding me in mail that my package is going to get delivered today and it's going to get delivered the other day. Why? She was like, yes, we're going to just check right now. Anyway, I was waiting on the line. Anyways, anyways, waiting on the phone. A whole damn 15 minutes. The girl said to me, I'm sorry, miss, but it's probably that it got delivered. Maybe you can check at your neighbors. I'm like, you know what? Yes, I can check at my neighbors. Can be possible, you know? I'm going to check and then I'm going to call you back. She was like, yes, no problem. I wear, literally, I went downstairs, knocked at my both my um, neighbors' door. They opened and they were like, no, we didn't get no package. I'm like, okay, someone is playing me for fool right here. It's either Pastanel, one of my neighbors, or the side that I order off. So um, I went until the next morning, still no side of the package. I called Pastanel again, and she said to me, I think the best thing that you can do is just call the side that you order from and see um, if there was a problem in between because I just see in the system that it got delivered here and also got delivered at your doorstep. I called and um, the sir was like, um, no problem, miss. You know what we're going to do? We're just going to refund the whole money for you. Two days after that, two days, not even one day, two days after that, I heard this on my door. I was standing in the kitchen and I heard this. You said I don't subscribe like... Subscribe, 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 subscribe. The girl was knocking on my door. I opened the door and I saw her with my packages. Did it fall from the sky? Because they were missing like for a few days already. And now all of a sudden you're going to deliver my package. Are you pasta now? Are you working for pasta now? Because girl... What happened to the packages? Did it got delivered by now? Hey, I just grabbed my packages. She, she said to me, um, sorry, did this for you. I grabbed my package. And uh, when I looked at the second package, I saw that it was ripped open. So somebody opened my package. I'm like, okay, am I going to text her and ask her why? What, what happened to the package? Did it got delivered right now? Or what, what happened? Well, I, like, I, I tried to understand, but I just, I just, I was like, you know what? I was in a good mood. I'm just going to let it slip away. Days went by. Um, there was one night. Um, it was raining so, so bad. And the wind was like, just to blow you away. Woke up the next day in the morning. Make my breakfast, minding my day, making school stuff, blah, blah, blah. In the evening is when I noticed that my fake grass carpet that I put in my balcony is missing. I'm like, hmm, where is my fake grass? So I went on my balcony and I looked on my balcony to see, you know, what happened. And then I noticed that my mop and my br um, broom is also missing. I'm like, okay, okay, okay. Let me just, you know, round downstairs, see if by any chance it's right in the area. I found my fake grass carpet, but still my broom and my mop was missing. I didn't mind. I'm like, nah, it's just a broom. It's just a mop. How expensive is that? You know, I'll buy another one. Not even one month after that, it was the whole drama with my landlord. Um, so of course the girl took the, 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 the studio, the studio that I was talking about in the other video, the one with the stairs to heaven and one step right into the devil zone, right where she belongs. Two days after she moved, I went to put my clothes in the washing machine and I was like being, you know, all in her business. I wanted to check out the studio because it's empty. Nobody is staying here. So let me check out the studio house to see how big it is. How is her balcony, you know, blah, blah, blah. And then at, my, at a glimpse. Isn't that my broom? 
What is my broom doing here? What is my broom doing here? I didn't even touch the broom. I literally, I didn't even touch the broom. I was like, I don't know if this girl got corona, if my broom is infected, but what is my broom doing here? My broom was missing for a few days already. What is it doing here? So, you're the one that stole my broom. So, still my mop was missing. So, of course, I'm like, yeah. She just went with the mop. How desperate can you be? Like, a broom, a mop, sis, a broom, a mop. Let's be serious. You don't have nothing else to steal? Like, nothing else? It didn't even stop right there. It even it even didn't stop right there. Minding you again, I just let it slide away. I didn't say nothing. I'm like, it's a broom. Have that thing. Just keep the broom. Keep the mop. Whatever you want. Have that. That exact same day, I went on my phone and I see that I got a message from a girl. Yes, it's Vanessa from Cosmopolitan. We were in contact two months ago and we selected you to be our ambassadors. So therefore, we send a package for you at your address that you gave to us. But we see um, that you still hadn't promoted your product on your um, Insta story. I'm like, hi, Vanessa. Um, I'm so grateful to be part of your team, you know, to be ambassador for Cosmopolitan. What's great, but... I just have one question. What package are you talking about? Because I didn't see no package. She was like, yes. Um, you, um, we sent you a package blah, 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 on this day. No, I didn't see no package, Vanessa. You know, I think that I'm bugging. I'm just going to check for sure. She went and checked. She was like, yes, on this exact, exact day, on this time, at this location and got delivered vanessa no no i didn't receive no package what exactly was in the package i think it was a lip balm okay but vanessa no i don't recall that i received a package that's if i if i received the package of course i would have promoted on my insta but i didn't receive that i ain't going to lie to you about that it can be that it um it got delivered at a neighbor because it can be that you weren't home i'm like mm -hmm, my neighbor i was like vanessa you know what i know what's the problem my neighbor stole my package she stole my package it's not the first time it's like it's been a few times already she was stealing my package so i think by sure she also stole this package and she didn't give them to me oh my gosh so how are we going to do with the following packages anyway blah, blah blah i send it from my new address so she can ship the thing to my new address but girl is it yours do you see your name on it you can probably see my name on it you can read, but you know damn well how to steal. Next time, tene bomang kami na solo ng tabria. Nasi mong grang favor. Halaga sa mi amo. Anyways, Coco fam, tell me, should I text her and told her that I know she was stealing my packages or not? Let me know in the comment section below. Let me know. But hey, that was it for this video. I'll see you next time. And follow my Insta, follow my Insta, because I'm going to post a poll again. If you guys want to see a live update, how I'm doing, how everything went down with my landlord and my lawyer, or if you guys want to see the whole moving process. So, Coco fam, thank you for watching till the end, and I'll see you. Ciao, Coco fam. Good,